Well, last time on Fumiko, we consumed Wilson's stupid face, or existence, and he was apparently an AI as well, which confuses me, but uh, we found another path to go on. I don't want to do this anymore. I don't want to destroy things. What did I do to him? I'm acting based on traces of information, shallow assumptions about my surroundings. Not Wilson was totally evil. I don't care what happened to Wilson, he deserved it. He probably deserved even worse than whatever I freaking did to him. Am I really misguided? I want to know. Oh, can't. Oh. I just. I was just dashing and I thought that square was dash. It's so weird. What is that? Oh, it freaking ate my dash! No! What are you? No, 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 no. Ow. Whoa. Not from, I'm not particularly familiar with what just happened there. Alright, so don't get near those. I thought it was just going to bump me around, but I guess those got upgraded as well. Where are we? Nope. Oh! Huh? What? Whoop. Excuse me? Did I go too close to the walls? Did I... Huh? What? What? Uh, are the, the, the red blocks death? But they're everywhere. They're, that's that's gotta be cut. Whoa! Did you have to stay in the middle or you die? I guess. The, again, this is like. It needs to be a bit more clear what what, what is killing me. No! Oh, Freaking whatever. If those things catch you, you're just you're just done. So it's just like a general ring around you. I guess I mean it is red. Red is death in this game, but I just figured that was cosmetic. Oh frick. Oh goodness, oh goodness. No, not towards, not the walls. No, not those either. Okay, okay, we're doing okay. Okay. The, the, confusing, but not. Ooh, pretty. Go to the rainbow. The glitchy rainbow. Best kind of rainbow. Oh, I thought that was like a trail going up, but it's just like over. Whoa. It's kicking in. Shaggy, that wasn't weed. Okay, are we? Did we escape? <laughs> it's really cool that the. I thought it was just like a waterfall of colors, but it's in fact the, the zero zero ones. That's, that's a really cool fact that you kind of. That reveals itself as you get close. Oh no. What happened? I'm one with the universe. Oh, I'm purple. I am purple. I'm dancing. I'm very slow dancing. I'm learning. I just decided this would be the good time to learn to teach myself to do the ballerina dance. Ballet. Whatever. Now I'm back to green. Or blue. Or I, orange. Whatever. I'm every color. I'm all of the colors. Which is actually just white. But still. Oh! And now I'm gone. Now I'm no colors. Did we do it? Did we save Digital Land Place? What did what did we do exactly? We just kind of deleted the bad guys, but hmm. Don't be a cliffhanger. You're not allowed to be a cliffhanger. We left the network. To where? The end. I just said you couldn't be a cliffhanger. Fell by no! It is a cliff Aw! Oh. It was a cl Well, we left the network. Physics face movement. Bring his hand to my garden. Huh. 
That's a, that's a that's a pretty dot hack ass ending, I will say. Omega <laughs> was created by accident modifying this model and placing it in a colorful environment. Thank you. <laughs> wow. Huh. I love when developers tell like stories like that. Like, there was this game. I was really not interested in the game, but somebody. Um, oh, Kevin McLeod music. He has lots of royalty-free stuff he can use. You hear lots of Flash games using his stuff. Very good stuff. Um, yeah, there was this game. Uh, I don't even remember what the game was, but he said um, he made the money to start um, to buy Game Maker Pro and stuff, or whatever it was. I think it was Unity. Um, he got his dev tools by selling, um, like, whatever... Team Fortress 2 crap. I'm so out of the Team Fortress, I could not care less. But it was really neat that he had sold that stuff. I didn't know you could even get real money. Like, how does that... I thought you could only get Steam monies or trade on things. I don't know, I always stay, like, 18 miles away from any of that Steam trading crap. I, I honestly, I honestly hate that stuff. Um, the only thing it's ever been to me is it's made people who I'm only vaguely familiar with suddenly like whine that oh my god top top do you want to troll your stupid hat for my stupid pick? It's such a good troll top top. And I'm just like, I don't, I barely even remember who you are. If you ever ask again, I'm deleting you from my friends list. <laughs> I don't know who most of the people are on my Steam friends list. The, the one problem with Steam, Steam's thing you can change your name at any time, and people do that way too freaking much. Send your feedback to Fumiko. Well, if you've watched, I think, the developer I think it does watch, and thank you for watching. I always, I always really love to hear when a developer like uh, watched or enjoyed a video and was like, yeah, it just feels good um, to know that, you know, they're checking your stuff out, seeing your feedback. Maybe they won't change the game, but maybe they will. Who knows? But I think the developer for Fumiko, they were they were pretty interested in trying to tweak things up a bit. I do I really dig the story. Uh, can you do chapters or how does that work? Reset slot. So what is exit game? Just continue. I do want those memory bits, but I'm not sure I want to totally replay. Aw, oh, frick. Yeah, it just starts us back here, not, uh... Hmm. What do we... Oops. No, how do I... Let's check out the Achievos. Or, yeah, to finish a thought, you can change your name on Steam, and some people just do that, like, every week. And, um... I, talking to Anomi and Hyperion, that was really cool and creepy. Solve the Cronus puzzles. Oh, okay. What factor had the barriers give for access? Huh. I kind of do want to do that. I think I'll see if I can figure out Cronus's thing. Though I, frick, I might have to replay like the whole thing. I don't. I don't know. I kind of just want those memory fragments. I would do the Cronus puzzle, but I'm not sure I want to do the whole thing again. Uh, maybe I'll wait to see if there's like updates. Cause like there was at least the slow fall thing was gonna happen. I think. Uh, I don't know what else they would do. Who was it? Oh, right, death. But yeah, that that was Fumiko. Um. Actually, let me just pause it up in menu. Uh, can I get back to the main menu from here? I don't. I don't think I can. Hold on. Space shift. Quick game. Level progress. Parts of level. Shift. I don't think. Oh, yep. I sure closed it. Okay. I just want to see if, like, I assume this starts you totally over, right? Are we back in the? Yeah. Yeah, it's probably just totally. Yeah. Hmm. Well, that was Fumiko. I was kind of wondering if it would do a bit of a open-ended ending. Not that it's always a bad thing, but uh, that was really interesting. I do think gameplay could be a bit frustrating, but 
it was never really rage quit level. Um, I've definitely like it was. It wasn't Rain Worlds. I can say that. <sighs> Rain World. I, <laughs> I honestly, I would not have played that for more than an, even an hour uh, if it weren't super beautiful. I was not expecting. Like, I was not expecting that to be remotely as crazy as it is. Yeah, I'm not sure. At least not now. I don't think I want to replay the whole thing now. Um, <laughs> frick. Uh, I wish I wish I would have gotten some form of warning that just going up would completely, like, prevent me from doing the whole Kronos thing. Because I did want... I wanted those memory things. But, uh... Oh well. That's this is the perfect way to end this series. Me accidentally pressing the explode myself button. Best best button. I think I pressed that intentionally like two or three times in that one fight. And um I pressed it accidentally like eighteen thousand times. See I initially thought that this would be like a thing. I think this is maybe why the game doesn't make maybe the best first impression, but when I first played this, I thought it was going to be like, you know, some kind of like level select and a 3D platformer and like you know, just climb a pillar and you know, after you beat this level, it would make another. I didn't really think it was going to be, you know, I guess making a surprise like that can be cool. But I guess in general, it's kind of I guess inconsistent would be my main complaint in general. Oh man, I, f I do love the colors. The colors are very good. Um, and the visuals in general, but sometimes the visuals, like especially when the 2D stuff interacts in a 3D space, it ends up a little. F it ends up being a little. Uh, a little confusing. Wee. But yeah, that was Fumiko.